This is an adventure. Intelligence first blossomed in the dark. In the dark. In the dark. In the dark. A thin layer of gray matter grew like a slime mold over the primitive olfactory bulb, crudely memorizing and analyzing chemical varieties and gradients that surrounded it. This is an adventure. An adventure. But intelligence wasn't content thinking in the dark. Sensitivity to photons eventually drew us upright onto bipedal bodies. It is an exploration. We're surveying space and its content at a glance catapulted us toward complex thinking in the light. In the light. Scientific reductionism applied to human physiology has contributed a wealth of self-understanding and self-knowledge to the human species. This is an adventure. But scientific reductionism itself simply is not enough. It is an exploration. While most people readily perceive with five basic bodily senses, smell, taste, touch, sound, and sight, our sensitive and our intellective faculties, working in harmony together, give rise to an emergent, emergent. authentically new sense of perception, new sense of perception. our sense of truth. 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 It is an exploration. This is an adventure. When it dawned into existence, the truth sense was a new type of metaphorical light illuminating the thinking universe. Many scientific and philosophical questions about our truth sensibility are unanswered. Are there some people whose sense of truth is brighter and stronger than that of others? Is the sense of truth something that we can exercise like a muscle and make it grow? It is most certainly a trademark human capacity, but is the sense of truth a uniquely human endowment? Lastly, if our sensitivity to perceiving greater light and truth can genuinely expand as individuals and as a species, then what vast, unrealized potential does life contain for us? This is an adventure. It is an exploration. I'm not certain where it will go, but I know I want to go where it leads. My name is Michael Ferguson. I'm a neuroscientist, a poet, and a philosopher. I invite you to journey with me into the Luminous Brain. The Luminous Brain podcast launches Thursday, February 1st, with the first of a three-part interview of renowned social psychologist and New York Times bestselling author, Jonathan Haidt. Visit our website, luminousbrain.com, to sign up for notifications of future episodes. You can also join our Facebook page and follow us on Instagram. And if you really want to support this project and get access to exclusive Luminous content, please consider joining our Patreon page. The Luminous Brain Podcast. The Luminous Brain Podcast. Coming soon to an auditory cortex near you.